What is going on, guys? Welcome back to yet another episode. We are here in the Tree Viper Room today. So what's going on guys? I know we haven't been in here in quite some time. I've been working on some little side projects in here, getting some finishing touches done on, well, well this cage. Um, so I did actually finish the water feature. With the exception of live plants, um, I got all the sand I needed in there, all the driftwood I needed in there, the lights all looking good, oh, phenomenal. So right now I currently actually have the North Philippine Temple Vipers in here, which they actually both just ate a meal for me yesterday. So they're pretty kind of chill right now. I'm hoping this one's actually grab it, which would be amazing. Um, the Waggler's Viper is actually currently at my sister's right now, just until I get done uh, with this new project I got going on. But yeah, there's a little mushroom growing right there. <laughs> so I actually took out all of the squams out of this cage and only left a pair in here which is the new female i got and the i believe the yellow male yes so they're the only two in this cage right now i'm actually going to probably take this cage apart and redo it now that i've kind of mastered my little technique with these cages i want to redo this one um just the walls and everything like that um, i do have the pairs behind me so i have my single green male there um the other female with the purple male in that second one there. I'm hoping maybe to get try and get some purple babies because they're just awesome purple snakes. What else? What else? All of the baby squams are gone. But one pair. I have one pair left. Um, I've been trying to sell them on Instagram. Nobody has wanted them yet. So if you have your permits and you were here in the States and you would like the last pair of baby squams, find me on Instagram and message me. That's going to be the best way. But yeah, lots of stuff going on in here. If you haven't seen it yet, I also have this big black coffee table. What could that be? I don't know. Let's talk about it. So this thing is massive. So it's 20 inches by 4 feet. And it also weighs about 150 pounds. Um, it's 18 inches off the ground. But again, what could that possibly be besides the coffee table? It's actually the stand. The stand to a new cage. So this thing is epic, and I do mean epic. So I want a huge thank you to Custom Cages. They supplied me with this cage. They're sponsoring this build. Oh, it's gonna be awesome. Before I show you the actual cage, let me show you this thing coming to my house. Oh man, guys, it is here. It is here, I'm so happy. It is here. My neighbors are absolutely gonna hate me. Yes, so this cage is literally four foot wide by four foot tall by 20 inches deep on an 18 inch stand. So this thing's gonna sit this high off the ground. Phenomenal, absolutely phenomenal. I could fit in this cage. I could literally sit down in this cage. It's got sliding glass doors on the front, okay? I also got a hole pre-drilled right there. So that's where the water is gonna come out. I'm actually gonna be putting bulkheads on this cage today so this is a bulkhead all right so i can put slide in pvc pipe on both sides and then you come over here there's two more holes there also one inch and a little bit smaller one there that's going to be for a fogger that's going to be for the water to come out giant waterfall um, and another hole i can actually possibly run cords out if i need to say for heaters and things like that hi guys you can see my reflection um but yeah so epic I am so in love with this cage. So again, huge shout out to Custom Cages. I'm going to be putting all of their information in the description below if you guys want to check out some of their cages. So sick. Enough of that. I know you guys want to see new stuff because everybody loves new stuff. So I got some new snakes. Didn't buy any of them, but I got new snakes. 
So I did happen to get another one of the blue insulars is back from my sister's house. Doing phenomenal. The other two are also doing pretty good. But I took this one off her hands. One less thing for her to deal with. So he's now back here at the house. Fresh into quarantine. But wait, there's more. So these cute little guys. Oh, if I can open it. There we go. Boom. Is that a little rattlesnake? Why, well, yes. Yes, it is a little rattlesnake. So, beautiful pair of Northern Pacific rattlesnakes. I believe that one is actually the female here. I believe this one is the male. Oh, you went potty. So that's the male. You can see the female is actually a lot more red than he is. So cool. So I got those guys from uh, Premier Predators, Ryan over at Premier Predators. Um, awesome YouTube channel. If you guys haven't checked them out, you should definitely check them out. Um, as for the baby eyelash vipers as well. So most of you guys know there's three of those left. Come to find out, I called the kid. I was like, hey, come pick up, you know, because I was going to keep one of them. Come pick up the other two. And he's like, no, just keep them. They're yours. You've been taking care of them. So I was like, yeah, sure. Why not? I'll keep them. So now I have three new eyelash vipers. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to give you guys a little update on everything going on. Super excited. Uh, this cage is so big and it's probably going to take me a little while to build i'm going to film it for you guys i'm going to put it up there on the tubes just for you guys so you guys can check it out um, it'll probably be a couple of videos um building it one video uh planting it probably another video putting the snakes in it probably another video um yeah because the snakes that are going to go in there they're going to look really good i'm actually getting plants from just their area where they come from um, with you know my, my buddy over at frosker.com who is my pretty much aquarium or paludarium or vivarium uh, guy he's looking into certain plants for these snakes where they come from um, so they get all native stuff um, the wood the waterfall everything it's gonna be oh, so excited about it. I don't think I've ever been this excited for a cage build yes but that's it for this one, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Like always, remember, subscribe if you are not already. Smash that like button if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next video, like always. Have a great day. Big thank you to my Patreons. You guys are awesome. Um, I'm going to be doing a live stream this week on the other YouTube channel. I will have it at the end of the video. So make sure you guys follow that channel. Let's talk about some stuff. Talk about some animals. Love live streams. Haven't done one in a while. So... Stay tuned for that. Bye.